Leading the newscast, South Korea has banned its citizens from visiting North Korea to prepare for a joint event symbolizing cooperation between the two Koreas. Meanwhile, Pyongyang criticized Seoul on Sunday for turning down the offer for civilian level talks. Our Jim Young Gil reports. June 15th marks the 13th anniversary of the June 15th joint declaration between North and South Korea, promoting the idea of reunification through economic cooperation and cultural events. With the anniversary not far off, Pyongyang extended an invitation to a civilian group in South Korea to prepare for the joint event. The South Korean committee who received the invitation had pushed for the meeting to be held this Wednesday. However, Seoul's unification ministry said Sunday that it will not allow the committee to make the trip north, as government-level talks must precede any dialogue that involves civilians. Inter-Korean relations had not been rosy since former President Lee Myung-bak's administration, but as President Park Geun-hye took office, North Korea upped the ante with endless threats. The two countries are currently in gridlock over the suspension of the joint Kaesong Industrial Complex in early April. South Korea had proposed working-level talks since the halt of the business park, but North Korea has declined, only offering civilian dialogue instead. To ease the current stalemate, progressive groups, opposition lawmakers and businessmen with factories in Kaesong have asked Seoul for more flexibility in opening up opportunities for dialogue between the South and North. Kim Young-gil, Arirang News.